Today, Governor Jay Inslee said limited COVID vaccines are holding the state back from vaccinating a lot of people quickly, and the U.S. government says it just finalized a deal to send more supplies to states. So King 5's Ted Land has details on when that shortage might start to ease up. Safeway, which has 177 pharmacies in Washington, started administering COVID vaccines in its stores Thursday. Appointments in many locations booked up fast. The expansion to retail storefronts is a sign the U.S. is ramping up vaccine distribution, reaching more people each week. If you look at the projection, I would imagine by the time we get to April, that will be what I would call for, you know, for better wording, open season, namely virtually everybody and anybody in any category could start to get vaccinated. Dr. Fauci says it'll still take several months after that to get the overwhelming majority of the country fully vaccinated in mid to late summer. That effort will be bolstered by an increase in vaccine supply. The Biden administration says it just finalized a deal with drug makers for 200 million additional doses, which should provide enough supply for nearly every American to get vaccinated. This is ultimately our salvation. We are ready to do many fold the vaccinations that we have vaccines today. We have the vaccinators, we have the supply people, we have the data people. All we need is, is the vaccine. Right now, CVS and Walgreens are not providing COVID vaccines in Washington state, but the companies say as more supply arrives, they will expand to serve additional states. Ted Land, King 5 News. With many people waiting for the vaccine, our exclusive King 5 News poll shows a large number of people don't want to get it. 26% said no, they will not. Another 18% you see there in the gray said they just weren't sure. Vaccine experts say 70% of the population needs to be vaccinated to reach herd immunity. So we asked the governor today what he thought of the results. Uh, in that realm, we would be close or at the level the science is telling us could be herd immunity. So you might look at that as good news as they see their neighbors and their coworkers and their relatives get the vaccine and do well, don't get COVID, don't have adverse impacts. Uh, the people who don't want to get the vaccine is going to go down fairly dramatically. I, I really believe that. He added that a big part of getting people vaccinated is educating them about how safe and effective it, it is. The governor's office is running ads in 32 languages explaining this to people.